Hey guys, how's it going? I'm I Jordan B1409, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can get the stun gun temporarily for GTA 5 online. This is thanks to a single play to multiplayer glitch I recently uploaded onto my channel. So, before I begin, I'd appreciate it if you could leave a like in this video for more GTA 5 glitches. Just shows me that you like my videos and like more, and it helps me get out there for other people to see. And also, be sure to subscribe for GTA 5 videos every day. I upload RP glitches, money glitches. Um, tricks, tips, DLC, and using from so much more. But anyways, let's get straight on this video. So what you're going to need to do, and I'm sure you're familiar with this now, is you're going to need to go to the Warstock website, website, should I say, and you want to go to the Rhino Tank, and you want to hover over by it now. When you hover over by it now, you want to hold Start for three seconds, and when you let go, you want to press A instantly afterwards. Now what will happen is it will come to this pause menu. Now you want to go to the Online tab. You want to hover over, leave GTA Online. When you hover over it, you want to press start, and what should happen is it will say you have insufficient funds. Now once again, hold the start button down for around 3 seconds or so, then when you let go, immediately after press A, and what should happen is you'll start transitioning to the game store, but the pause menu will also come up. This means that you now have to try and leave GTA Online quickly, before it fully transitions to the game store. Now once this happens, it will transition you to the game store, and then you just want to back out, and it will take you to um, online with your single player character. It will automatically bring up this Warstock website, so what you're going to need to do this time is instead of pressing the tank, you want to do it with the barracks this time, you want to hover over by it now, hold the start button down for 3 seconds or so, let go, press A, and um, it should bring up this pause menu. Now what you need to do when the pause menu is up, you just press start, and what will happen is it will say you have insufficient funds, where you then once more have to press, um, well, hold the start button down for 3 seconds or so, then let go and press A, and this is X on um, PS3, in case you didn't know that. And what should happen is your pause menu will come up where you'll transition into the game store, but just leave the menu up this time while it transitions, and when you get to the game store, just back out, and what should happen is when you get back, you'll be able to move around as your single player character on GTA 5 Online, where you will now have the stun gun, if that's what you have on single player. Now if you don't have the stun gun in your inventory on single player, what you can do is you can go to ammunition and you can buy the stun gun from there. Um, but nevertheless, this is an awesome glitch where you can now walk around on GTA 5 Online, as you can see in the bottom left corner. I've got people on the radar and everything and I can now run around with the stun gun on GTA 5 Online. Um, and basically be Michael as well. So unfortunately, there's no way of permanently keeping this from what I know of anyway. I believe that there's like a weapon check on GTA 5 Online, so next time you load it up, it will check if you've got the stun gun and if it finds it, it will delete it. But maybe with this glitch, now we can get it onto online thanks to a glitch, that maybe we can somehow get it onto our GTA 5 online characters and make it stick. So this is a temporary glitch, like I said, as once you find a new session, what will happen is that um, it will, you'll go back to your normal character and the stun gun will be gone. But nevertheless, this is an awesome glitch and I definitely recommend you try it out. Um, it's definitely fun and I and I definitely like the stun gun. So uh, anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm sure to leave a like if it helped you. I'm sure to subscribe for GTA 5 content every single day on my channel. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Peace out.